So, you guys just watched me deadlift 475 for a 30 pound PR on my conventional deadlift, which it isn't much, but it's honest work. Like I showed in the beginning of the video, I failed a 465 deadlift on October 14th and I matched my best ever conventional deadlift of 445 the week before that and both those times I'm a lot heavier than I am now. I'm basically 10 to 12 pounds heavier than I am now and now I'm stronger. I didn't even want to try to go for 465 again. I, I loaded on 475 and said I'm good. I don't, I don't care that I failed 465 a month ago. I'm stronger now for sure so I'm gonna just load up more and I did it. And that was a 30 pound PR. I'm very happy with that. I was stuck at 445 for like 8 to 10 months because I just wasn't training very seriously, let alone training deadlifts very seriously. But now in these last two to three months I really I really gained my passion back for lifting. So I'm chasing my goals very zealously and I have 495 or 500 pounds on my sights. I want to do it beltless. So stay tuned for that. But now I want to talk about my back routine. A lot of people ask me what do I do for my back. Uh, a lot of times people ask me what I do for my lats, which honestly my lats are a huge lagging point. You could see in these pull-ups that middle outside of my back is my lats, right? It's not very big. What's big on my back are the two giant slabs of meat by my neck and how my uh, upper back juts out near the shoulder which is the teres major what's under that jutting out are my lats and you can see my lats are pretty lagging would i like my lats to be larger hell yeah but right now i have my priorities on something else maybe in the future i will specialize in lat training but regardless my back routine and my routine in general for any muscle is quite simple i keep it very simple very limited amount of exercises and all I do, as you can see, was deadlifts, band-assisted pull-ups. If I'm feeling fresh, I'll do them body weight. And I do rows, right? I do them twice a week. One day, I'm doing regular deadlifts, band-assisted pull-ups. The other day, I'm doing stiff leg deadlifts, band-assisted pull-ups, and rows twice a week. And should you copy me? I don't think so. I think you should copy the principles I'm having, which the core principles at play here are one, I have fun with my exercises, which leads me to train hard and train consistently at them. And that's number two, I train hard and I train consistently. And number three, I just feel them in my muscles. If I feel my muscles being worked in the exercise, then that's great. If you don't feel it, then maybe you should ditch that exercise. But that's all I have for tonight. Thanks for watching the video, you guys. Have a good night.